I, I, I don't see Donald Trump as having fundamentally changed the Republican Party. I've seen Donald Trump embrace what the Republican Party uh, stands, stands for. I, I think it's a mistake for the Republican Party to, to walk away from the fact that we are the majority party in the United States. We control more governorships, more uh, chambers of state legislatures, both uh, chambers of uh, the U.S. Congress. Uh, and therefore, uh, we have a party platform that Donald Trump really didn't mess with uh, radically. Look, in this election, uh, it goes without saying that I think he has some benchmarks that he has to hit. He, he can't do worse than Romney did with African Americans uh, and, and Latinos. Uh, and I think he has an opportunity to do better with uh, blue collar workers uh, and, and, and the white populace in general. He has a way of articulating these positions that's attractive to not only independents, but working class Democrats. He, he shouldn't run away from his positions that he holds on principle, uh, but he should in fact figure out a way of articulating them in a way that's attractive and, and inviting uh, to those voter groups. There's been this historic tension that Aristotle talked about, a tension between the organized power of the state uh, and individual liberty. The more powerful the state is, the more at risk individual liberty is. And so I've seen the Constitution of the United States as a harness, something that reels in the, reigns in the power of, of, of government. Uh, and so I've seen the Republican Party as being the constitutionalist party uh, in our two-party system. If we win this election, we will control the apparatus of government across the board. We will have no one to blame. We can't blame it on Obama. We can't blame it on Hillary Clinton. We can't blame it on anyone else. If, in fact, we control the presidency and both uh, chambers of the Congress, we then must, in fact, keep our word and advance an agenda that not only protects America, in the neighborhood, in our neighborhoods, and in the world, but actually protects uh, America or protects American interests economically by getting our economy growing again.